What's going on you guys? Welcome back to Breath of Fire. I haven't played this in a long time. So I'm getting back into it. I was originally gonna play some Animal Crossing, but you need a new, entirely new Switch if you want to play on a new island, so... That's not gonna happen right now, so I'm gonna go with this. Continue this game. I really, really want to get uh, to the part where... Um, what you call it? Where I get to the next area for this game. That's gonna be pretty fun whenever that happens, hopefully. Let me actually just do something real quick. I need to change the, the aspect ratio for myself. It's gonna automatically be done in the in the in the video because uh, I'm gonna stretch it back to the right resolution whenever uh, I I release this video. But you know. Anyway, you're fully recovered. Keep a close eye on. Okay. Apparently, I'm not that high level, so I'm gonna have to go through some grinding here. Uh, this episode, each episode will be only 10 minutes now. from now on. Uh, I think I did two parts, right? I'm pretty sure. I guess I forgot to save when I grinded up to level 12, so... <laughs> you guys are gonna have to join me on the grind. I hope you don't mind. Uh, okay, it doesn't do too much damage, and I almost one-hit him, so... As long as I get to uh, the first fountain, I can really easily grind. I'm probably gonna speed through it, so you guys don't have to see it. Uh, which means this this video is gonna probably be a little bit extra long. I need to get at least level, I think, 13 to be, beat it completely without issue. Oh come on, I'm messing it up. Okay, let's press the B button. There we go. So this is the first grind area uh, where you can slowly like heal yourself and uh, basically grind to the next level. And it's I mean I'm currently using my Game Boy uh, Game Boy Advance SP. To play this because you can use the Game Boy player cable for your GameCube which is the best way to play it honestly because you can play it using the Game Boy player uh, but you can't you can see the game on the Game Boy player of course that would be cool but I'm not sure how if that's even possible I don't think it is maybe if you have two copies of the game or something I don't know is there any monsters here Jesus Christ what the hell do I have to go to this area? I'm confused. 70 GP, GP gold uh, pieces, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Why is there no monsters here? That's really weird. Let's go to this area. Got a door to open. I guess I should keep going. For some reason, no monsters are attacking me, so... Oh, I think that's a good weapon. Hold on. Pressing the wrong buttons here. It's a lot easier when you actually have the Game, uh, game Boy controls. I really want a Game Boy Advance, uh, the original, to do this. Uh, but I'm gonna try to see if I can find one of those. So let's see. Can I get... Oh yeah. That's not it. Uh, equip. Let's see, is the bronze SD stronger? Yes it is. It's gonna remove active points, which is too bad, but I think that should be fine. Oh. Alright. Gonna keep attacking this guy. I finally got some monsters, that's good. I was like, where are all the monsters at? <laughs> Alright, nothing here. Okay, got getting some herbs, that's really good. I actually got, I think I got another good equipment here. Uh, let's see, gauntlet, yeah, that gives me more defense and more active, so I boosted the active back up, which is pretty good. Got a weird phantom thing. Alright, I think uh, the cool thing about this game compared to the second one is that they actually show the health bars even if you haven't battled the creature before. In the second game there's like a question mark when you haven't beaten the monster yet. Alright, three of them. Alright, let's do an auto here. Because I can one-shot them and the character can actually counter sometimes when they attack. And these only do like low HP damage, so it's not a problem. I'm pretty sure I can get to the actual boss without an issue here, so it should be fine. So th this game is actually... Also, I just bought these games because I wanted the original experience and uh, you can... I get. I guess you can maybe hook up a Game Boy Advance to your Switch, maybe? I don't know. I haven't really tried. 
because I have a GameCube to uh, GameCube to computer thing. Well, USB, I, I guess. Maybe that will make it work. I haven't really tried. I know that Super Nintendo controllers work. Uh, the uh, classic ones with the adapter I bought a while back. I really need to make a video on it for those who want to wonder what I'm talking about. Uh, it, it's a thing where you can make any controller wireless. Uh, you just have to, well, you can like sit far away and play if you have a battery for it. So you can sync it to your Nintendo Switch. And it actually has uh, the special buttons you don't get with normal controllers that are not supported with, uh, okay, I got some new items here. Let me see here. That's a bad thing. Oh, maybe I got some. Oh, I got a better armor. That's good. I remember for the first time I played the second game. Uh, my brother got that game. I never owned an, an advanced Game Boy. I only had the a Game Boy Color, but I actually got to play using his Game Boy uh, for a lot, which was really cool because I got to play through the entire second game, Breath of Fire 2, on Game Boy Advanced, and I like it way more than the the SNES release. Uh, I think that's the worst one. They really need to, uh, if they're ever gonna release some cool games, they should release Game Boy Advanced games. There's a lot of cool games that I wanted the advanced version of. Okay, I'm gonna probably use, need to use a herb. Yeah, next level, very nice. Let me actually check my inventory real quick. Just to see how many herbs I have. Okay, I guess I can use one. I'm gonna, gonna get really close to the next uh, next fountain. I think this is the area where I usually grind because there's a lot of harder monsters here. This guy's not hard though, so it's a whole lot easier if you do emulation. What? Okay, the Game Boy turned off. I don't know what happened. Maybe I need to swap the battery on this Game Boy. It doesn't seem to work correctly. Huh. Anyway. Maybe I just pressed some button that turned it off by mistake. Let's do auto. I've got a slam attack, which is, I think it's twice the damage of your normal attack if you get a slam, which is really good. Okay. Trigger the spoing. Oh, I recovered everything. That's good. I wish I didn't use my herb now. There's like traps that are good and bad. Alright, slam. Very nice. Getting a lot of hits, powerful hits, so <laughs> I don't need to do more multiple attacks. I usually do. I lost the AP. I don't need it because I don't have any magic, so that's fine. I don't. Oh no. I can't fight him yet. I'm already here. That was way too quick. I get. Oh, the next dungeon is the harder one. I was, I was like, wait a minute. Just one hit a KO these creatures. Let me actually check how much XP I need. Uh, okay. Stat. Alright, that's a lot of AP or e EP. I think I can actually beat him. Maybe? Let me just see. I can't really save right now, which kind of sucks. I have three herbs, so I might be able to beat him. Let's see if I can do it. I believe in myself. I think this is not the final boss. This is like the middle boss, maybe. Alright, slimeless human. Human, I will eat you. Uh, I'm just gonna do basic, normal attack so I can actually heal myself. Ooh, that, okay, yeah, I can see the HP bar. I can know how much damage I need to do. Yeah, I don't think he can heal. He does 6 HP. I got a counter attack and an actual attack. Very good. Oh, he did way more. I need to heal myself. Got some herbs. Ooh, okay, that was close. I think herbs do 50 hit points. Oh my, he's doing way more damage now. Okay, I beat him. He wasn't that hard. I think the next uh, dungeon is the hard one. I thought this was a hard dungeon, but then I realized I'm only level 4, so... Who knows, really. Got level f level 7. Luck went up too. Very nice. 
The foul air is filtering out, the fresh air is coming into the castle. Okay. Okay. Interesting. I got two boxes here. We got a herb and we got some gold. And I believe that now the, all, all the monsters are gone, so you can't really get back into this. But, you know, who knows really? Anyway. I guess there's not as much grind as, grinding as I thought in this game, which is pretty good for those who want to get through the game. Uh, eventually, one day, I want to make an animation on this uh, game. Uh, like a fully animated anime style animation. But I need to play through the game first, I guess, to get the story completely. That's a way to like look back at it, I guess. Alright, let's go. I guess we're going back up. I guess he took over the basement. That's weird. I guess I can go and heal in the fountain, so I don't have to worry about using items by mistake. Okay. Let's -a go, my dude. Do do. And uh, one of the reasons why I don't use, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, the re one of the reasons why I'm not using uh, webcam in this is because to make it, the process a whole lot easier for me uh, recording. Because uh, whenever I do face cam, I want to have it actually record on the camera. So that's the future, I guess, you can say. The scar looks familiar. Oh, I forgot to read. Sorry, guys. <sighs> Probably should read. What a shock. The Dark Dragons must have the Quake Control. There's a hidden palace in Nai... Na 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 Nanai? Uh, the Nanai Dungeon. Find the Quake Control and go there and put the end of these quakes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I need to do that. So, uh, first of all, I'm gonna actually save so I don't forget. Because uh, I'm gonna have to end the episode right here. Uh, yes, I'll tell you my story. Thanks so much. Alright. So that's all for this episode, you guys. I hope to see you guys in the next one. I will try to release at least one a day, hopefully, uh, if I can. Uh, each episode is going to only be 10 minutes long, so I hope you guys don't mind uh, short episodes for those who like your long uh, Let's Play videos. If you want them to be longer, just tell me in the description. Uh, I mean description, I mean comments. What am I talking about? Uh, if you want it longer or not, basically. That's all you have to do. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have an awesome day. Bye-bye.